Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do a reading for Cancer. This is for Cancer's Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, and this is for at any time in the month of December. But I have to let you know that not every reading is for you. I still get people that comment down below, stupid shit, you know, I'm just sorry, but you know, not every reading is for you. So if people, you know, I'm sorry, but I, I, no. This reading may or may not be for you. Take what resonates and leave the rest. What do we got for the month of December? Something in December. One at any time in December. Okay. So let's see. What do we got for Cancer? Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. You may be dealing with some life challenges. I just saw the Nine of Wands. You may need be needing to find this all the strength that you can. Like you're gonna have to persevere through something perseverance is needed so there could be some sort of challenge that you are dealing with wheel of fortune reversed so this is going backwards or stuck clinging to control somebody may, may be having a hard time moving forward it's like there's a cycle that needs to complete but there's resistance so somebody is resisting a cycle from ending it's like there's just too much resistance so this is bad luck you know, there's a, and this is interesting because before I did this reading, I was sitting here getting ready and I was thinking about free will. And this is a card of free will. We have a lot in destiny, free will and destiny. That's the meaning of this card in the upright or the reversed. You know, we get people that, and I'm not saying under you, it happened to be under a different reading. Somebody commented, um, this hasn't happened for me yet. So I was thinking about that comment. Free will plays a part. It does. If you choose to keep yourself stuck, well, that's that's bad news. That's bad luck. You have to take those steps. So we got somebody here that is refusing to take steps to change their destination with the Wheel of Fortune reversed. If you refuse, then you're going to go backwards. You're going to be stuck. So we have somebody here that is, it's like they're hindering their own reward because this is the wheel of fortune so when the things change when you accept change when you allow change that's when you receive a reward so somebody is hindering their own good fortune their own good luck their own reward by not taking the steps to change their destination Five of Wands reversed. So this is definitely struggling. Now it's like you're reluctant. Somebody is reluctant. Reluctant to give up. Reluctant to let go. Reluctant to... Serious reluctance with these both of these cards. It's like relief. There's an opportunity for relief. But you got to stop engaging. It's like you're engaging in something. Which is interesting. Um, and it's some sort of power struggles. It's a power struggle of some sort. It's like you're, you're competing. There's some sort of competition here that you need to stop engaging in. Woo. Knight of Swords. Now this is moving very quickly, moving too fast. Somebody may be moving too fast, not thinking. Maybe you need to think. Okay, I'm not saying that you're not, mate. this could be you, could be the person you're dealing with. Somebody is moving very fast. It's like they got this idea and they're just running with it without being logical, perhaps. Somebody could be being led into a dangerous situation where there is a lot of competition, just saying. This is moving very, very quickly. Now, this is this is this reminds me of the Tower card. In the it does because the thing something happens so fast, it's almost like a shock. So there could be some sort of shocking entrance. Something could happen suddenly. Somebody could be rushing, rushing in. Now this could be. This could even what I just heard in my head was police. So I don't know if this is police. Doesn't have to be. This is this is this could be even a knight in shining armor. 
for some of you. It could be. It could be anything. It could be anybody. This is somebody coming in very, very fast. So something comes in without notice by the looks of things. Something could be, well, somebody is trying to block something from happening. They're resisting. Oh, my God. Now, this is the Ten of Pentacles. This is at home or at work. This is a loss of, of a job or a loss of a home or moving home or a lack of stability at home, a lack of security. I mean, that's what it is. Something in both of these tens are reversed. It's somebody is trying to block something from ending, and it's going to end. So you're, you may be biding your time. This could be an official that is, is, is doing something. Okay. <laughs> this is very unstable. Some, th some This is an unstable situation. This is a loss of abundance or a change in the home front. Somebody could be moving. It's not, it's not stable there anymore. Or they're needing to move, but they're refusing. Could be dealing with a Leo, Aries, or Sagittarius. Doesn't have to be. This person is very controlling. We definitely have a very controlling individual here. Very manipulative. This, this is somebody, this could be somebody in protective services. Coming to shake things up. This person shakes things up. So there's probably going to be a shake up. Somebody has, and this is bad luck. Somebody may be receiving some bad luck because of their need to compete. This person is very competitive and this is a comp. There's a competitive nature here that may be biting somebody in the ass. Somebody may get bit in the ass. I'm just being honest with you. There could be a family feud or a family situation that is changing just like that. Somebody's been fighting destiny, though. Seven of... Definitely fighting destiny. Unbelievable. They do this for me all the time, right? This is a fight. Destiny. It's crazy how they come up. So somebody's, like, trying to stop something from changing. And it's, like... It's almost like they bit off more than they can chew. And now it's, like... This is a card of karma. So somebody could be in bad luck. The, the Wheel of Fortune reversed. So somebody may be dealing with some sort of karma. Now, may, somebody may be feeling judged or feeling like they're under attack. So you may need to defend yourself or you've been trying to defend yourself, protect yourself. This is a need to... Uh, well, this is somebody who feels like... They're being attacked. It looks like this person is going down, though. They're no longer on top. Somebody is going down. Could be you or the person that you're dealing with. These readings can go vice versa. Somebody is going down. They are. And I, can, I totally can see that. These are all down. And things are going to be turned upside down by this person. So we got five cards that are reversed. This one is upright. It's like there's somebody rushing in that is going to turn a person's life upside down. And I think that it stems, I think this is some sort of official, okay? I don't know what kind of official this is, but I think that's what this is. This person's got the truth and the power. So this person has power and truth in their hand. So it's like they have the ability to make some sort of it looks like a cut of some sort or a choice or something like that. This person is moving very, very quickly. Now, this person is probably shallow, um, controlling, manipulative, and it doesn't matter what sign it is. This is somebody who is lazy, has a self-image problem. So you could be dealing with somebody who has been holding another person back. There's a lack of, of emotional fulfillment here. There's a loss of love, a loss of, um, of emotional fulfillment. Somebody is shutting down. Uh, emotionally. Could be dealing with a Leo. We have a Leo twice. So I'm not sure if you are, but this is getting weak, growing weak, lack of strength. 
This person can't, ma there's going to be some tears as well. This is can't master emotions. So I think there, it's, there's going to be tears. I'm sorry, Cancer. This is not what you want to hear. But this is who I am. So there's, there's a uh, weakness, sickness, illness. There's a lot of uh, negative uh, pride here. A lot of bad, it, it's like ego, seriously, bad ego. So we got somebody who has a really big ego that definitely has a self-image problem that has been stalling or has been hindering something. And I think that somebody is going to receive some karma. It could be, if you are dealing with a Leo cancer, it's the Leo that is going to receive this. It could be you. I don't know, but this is this is a massive change that is going to happen like overnight. This person is weak, ill, uh, maybe even sick. Definitely, um, it's almost like miserable. Wow. Eight of Swords reversed. Now this is be escaping from prison, escaping from confinement. Somebody has been contained, but they're going to be broken free. There's an obstacle that is finally being removed. Somebody has been trapped in a negative situation, but I think they're this person's coming to break them free. Okay, this is like a hero. Remember I said knight in shining armor. So there's somebody that is being broken free from some sort of mental situation where there wasn't love there wasn't emotional fulfillment this person is um low vibrational put it that way we have a low vibrational being who is holding somebody back it's like they're so controlling this is clinging to control and i think there's going to be a change and it's going to be sudden it's going to be a sudden change Ah, uh, Knight of Wands reverse this reckless. Somebody's been moving too fast. I I have to be honest with you. I mean, you got to be careful. There could even be a, I I don't like to say it, but when you get these two cards and they're kind of opposing each other, there could be a car accident. Somebody could be moving too fast. Okay? This is rushing and this is rushing. So something is happening because somebody has been moving. They're not thinking. They're not thinking before they act. And because they're not thinking, they're saying things or they're doing things that just don't add up. So, and there's somebody that is definitely overly competitive. This is overly competitive, overly competitive, overly competitive. So somebody's overly competitive situation is going to get them in trouble. So I don't know if it's you or the person that you are dealing with. There's going to be a sudden departure. It's like sudden, sudden. There is. There is. There's going to be some sort of sudden departure here. It's like somebody suddenly leaves or gets taken away. This person has a chip on their shoulder. They think that they know it all. And it's like somebody's going to see right through them. This person doesn't want any responsibility, doesn't accept, doesn't even know what responsibility is. Very lazy. We have a lazy individual here is going to get some sort of bad luck because they don't take any initiative. I don't know if it's you or the person that you're dealing with. Um, an obstacle is definitely being removed. There's been some lies. Somebody's been lying. You're, somebody is somebody is definitely dealing with a fire sign Aries Leo Sagittarius and that might be the person that is lying I do think it is I think that that is who you are this person is lying I don't I honestly don't think it's you cancer I don't this has to do with a fire sign and I think this fire sign uh, their competitiveness and their bad decisions and their poor choices is going to catch up to them I don't I, for some reason I don't think it's you I think that somehow you are in this mix and you're just going to see it. You're going to see it all happen. How does this affect cancer? How does this affect cancer? I don't think it's you. I, I don't know why. Now, this is working together. The three, how does this affect cancer? Now, this is teamwork working together. This is going to give you some sort of respect for some. This is respect. It's like somebody is going to be watching you. They're going to see what you can do. For some reason, it's like they're going to have their eyes on you. 
Somebody's going to be looking at you. They're going to see what you can do. They're going to see what you have to offer. What the hell is this? I think that you maybe there's you're going to receive some sort of communication in regards to this situation. Somebody is about to experience a midlife crisis. This is a midlife crisis. The hermit reversed. This is this is lack of awareness. You may not be aware. You may not be aware of the truth. You may not be aware of what is going on. But I think some, some sort of light is going to be shed on a situation that may shock you. You're somehow involved in this. I think you're going to be shocked with the events that happen. Probably, I would say these events will probably happen um, very soon. Very, very soon with all these wands energy. That's very fast moving energy. Um... Maybe five five days. I'm just guessing. <laughs> that came out for a reason. Um, some sort of light is going to be shed on a situation. Maybe it's a third party situation. I don't know. And third party situations don't always have to be sexual. Somebody has been acting impulsively, acting out of pride, acting in a, out of ego, being definitely overly competitive. And their overly competitiveness is going to get them in trouble. And I think they're going to experience some sort of bad luck or karma or something, some sort of loss because they couldn't give up. They couldn't uh, swallow their pride and, and let go. Very pride, a lot of pride here. And this pride and ego is going to get them, somebody is going to fall. Okay, they're going to they're gonna be taken down, whatever that means. Somebody is going to be, they're, they're, they're going to feel like they have been under attack or they're going to feel like they're attacked. They're no longer going to be on top. They're going to be on the bottom. Perhaps you're going to get it be on top. Maybe now you're going to be on top. Oh, there's that nine of wands I saw at the very beginning. Yeah, you are going to be facing some life challenges. And you're going to need strength. You are definitely going to need strength. Whew. Amazing. It is. I feel as though... You may be left to fend for yourself. You may be on your own with these two cards. Maybe somebody's going to see your strength. They're going to see your nobility. Whew. The loss of power here. I think there's a shift in power. I think power goes from someone's hands into another's. It's like there's going to be some sort of loss. Somebody's been being lied. There's been lies. There's been manipulation. Somebody's been totally manipulating another person and I think that you may maybe you didn't see it maybe you didn't believe it but you're about to see it I think some sort of lies are about to be revealed and somehow you are in the mix so be prepared for that there definitely is okay somebody hasn't been telling the truth and they're gonna lose their power whoever this person is that you are dealing with there's a loss of power some there's power is shifting hands I think that your perseverance is going to pay off in some way. It feels like whoever this person, some, somebody's going to maybe see your capability. Maybe they're going to um, have more respect for you because this person's uh, truth is going to come out. Who this person really is. It's like, so the... the uh, maybe it's the feelings... Okay, but the Ace of Cups reverse, they shift and does it have to be the feelings, but I, there's definitely going to be a loss. I think we've been dealing with a fire sign. I feel like it's a, it is a fire sign that has been manipulating a situation. Could be a Gemini, I suppose, or a Virgo or a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius or whatever. I really feel strong fire though. I feel like we have a master manipulator here that has been getting away with something and I think that... Uh, their overly competitive nature is going to, uh, it's basically send out red flags to whoever is judging them because this is being judged. And I think that it's going to get them in trouble and they're about to fall. They're about to fall off their high horse. It's like that chip is about to be pew, right off their shoulder. So be prepared for that. 
Um, somebody hasn't been telling the truth, but I feel like this person knows the truth and you're probably going to hear it, whatever this truth is. This is a, something happening very suddenly, something fast. What is this Knight of Swords going to do? They're going to break something up. This person's going to break up this hoorah, whatever it is. Whew, somebody's dealing with a Leo. Could have to do with a child. There could be even a, a change in residence for a child. Okay, a child could be leaving, or so, I'm just being honest with you. Okay, um, this is both of these cards are no. So there's there's like no 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 no. What you're saying is not the truth. Somebody because underneath there it's, it's not the truth, and that ace of swords. Somebody it's, it's like somebody doesn't believe. They don't believe this person anymore. Um, something hasn't been growing effectively. This is the lack of growth. Not poor health. Somebody's been lying and manipulating, and the truth. This person is going to reveal a uh, unhealthy situation, whatever that is. This is not healthy. There's no growth. This is not a healthy situation at all. So I think some sort of some sort of truth is going to come out about an unhealthy situation. Um, whew. Sun card reversed. That's that's unhappy. Somebody's not going to be happy. I think it's this could be the Leo, 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 and then underneath here the Queen. Oh, somebody's really not going to be happy. Um, de somebody's dealing with a very negative individual who has a serious self-image problem. So this ain't good. Holding on to a dead end, resisting change. And this is the last card. First card, last card. Somebody is resisting letting something go. They're resisting an ending which needs to end. This card wouldn't come out if it wasn't meant to end. Something is meant to end and somebody is blocking it. They're clinging to control. This person is so controlling. Their, their need to control is going to bring them backwards. And I don't mean just a little bit. This cycle is going to end. And somebody's about to learn a big lesson. So be prepared for a, something big in your life. That you are either directly involved in or you are on the sidelines watching. There's going to be a major completion this month. And you are somehow involved. Good luck.